Hello friends, in this video we will discuss the question number 11 of the computer science gate paper of 2022 and in this question they are asking us to mark all the statements which are true for the positive function f of n. Now uh, we are given there are four options and we have to tell which one of them is true. So let us say that for polynomial function f of n is equal to 2 a multiply by n. 2n is the f of n function. Now if you look at the uh, option 1, it says that if we put the value of n as n square, then this function will become 2n square and then uh, we are saying that the theta is going, the f of n whole square is going to bind this particular f of n on both the sides which means that 4n square which is uh, when we take this value and we square this it becomes 4n square. So this is going to bind this value on both the sides. Now this will be true for the values of c1 and c2. For higher side it is not very difficult. We can multiply it with any integer 2, 3, 4, 5 and it will always be on the higher side and for the lower side c2 we can multiply it with half or something like this. So if we multiply it by half it will be binding on the lower side as well. So this option is correct but let us check if some other option is also true. Now if we look at this option then it says that uh, f of n square is going to bind is, is going to be binded by the f of n whole square on the higher side for whatever value of c that we are going to take. But if we take the value of c to be a fraction like a half or 1 by 4, then this value will not hold. So this is not the correct option. Then if we say that it is an exponential function, f of n is an exponential function, then say the easiest exponential function that we have is 2 raised to power n. Now if we put n as n square, it will become 2 raised to power n whole square. And if we take a whole square of f of n, that is 2n ka whole square, it will become 2 raised to the power of 2n. Now if this fun function is not a big O binding for the 2 raised to power of n square and therefore this will not this option is also not correct and if we look at this option which says that in the polynomial function say that f of n square is going to be binded by the f of n whole square on the lower side this is not true because f of, uh, 4n square will not bind on the 2n square on the lower side. And nothing is mentioned whether it is exponential or whether it is a polynomial and it is a very general statement. So we will stick to our first choice that answer A is the correct answer for this question. I hope this video is useful to you. If you like the video, please subscribe to the channel and you can ask your queries and questions in the comments box and uh, you can share the video with your friends and uh, that will be very helpful and thank you very much.